Hi, I'm Owen Pettiford and welcome to uh, TechEd Live. I'm here with Sven and Philip to talk to you about the announcement around the S4HANA SDK. So Sven, tell me, um, why should partners be excited about the SDK? So first of all, the extensions for S4HANA Cloud, which is the most modern ERP in the cloud you can have, inherits already a uh, digital user interface, the experience, the AI is embedded, and of course we support next generation processes. So there's a natural tendency of customers to adopt more and more, and we're happy with the adoption. That does mean, though, that the ecosystem, of course, now is in the position to build micro verticals, which we're not going to do. And for that, I think they deserve a software development kit on our most open platform to exactly do that. And we do have already great examples we talked about where not only the time of development was reduced, but also now for the market, because you get included in a marketplace and a go-to market, you can really get that out fast. Okay, that's, that's interesting. So, so, Philip, from a technical side, you're the technical guru behind the SDK. Um, talking to a, a technical audience, what are the what are the key features that they're going to enjoy from the SDK? Sure. Well, with the SDK, you get a lot of capabilities, but let me just highlight three of them. The first is that we brought the entire public model of S4HANA, like the entities and all the services which are, for example, exposed by the API Business Hub, directly into the programming language, for example, for Java, which we have already for a year, and now recently also for JavaScript to implement Node.js-based applications using really the entities directly in the programming language uh, without really fiddling around with all the APIs manually. Then you get a lot of engineering patterns uh, for multi-tenancy, for resilience, things you need in the cloud and make this simple. For example, then authenticating seamlessly against S4HANA cloud or on-premise, even though the technical integration is slightly different, uh, you write the code once and it runs against all those options automatically for you because the heavy lifting is done inside the SDK. And the last part is, and this was even shipped as open source as a continuous delivery toolkit to continuously deploy the software built with the SDK onto the cloud. In SAP we do this 20, 30 times per day with our cloud-based applications. And customers and partners can now do exactly the same. This is this continuous delivery pipeline essentially is ADC, transport management, and much more in one single a simple to use tool, which is even open source on GitHub. And maybe to add to that, we at SAP use exactly the same SDK, exactly the same tools, right. and we give exactly the same to the ecosystem, which I think is very important because we both are into this. Okay. And that's interesting. So SAP are using it to build their own um, add-ons to the S4HANA uh, platform. Can you give us some examples of where partners are using it as well? Absolutely. Um, let's take an example like Beyond Technology. So build a visual planner on top of, of maintenance. They actually, uh, part of the announcement as well, and here talking also to other partners and customers, reduced their development time by 50%. And they will, of course, leverage to put that out. Another partner is CBS that did a stock consignment app. And this one is specifically interesting, not only because it's available on the marketplace to download, it works for an S4HANA on-premise, for an S4HANA cloud, and even for an ERP. So you build once and you can leverage in multiple of those solutions. Okay, so really delivering on the, the vision that um, an API first strategy leads to being able to build uh, portable solutions, which you is bet. great. So, you um, bet. so where, would, uh, where would developers go next um, or partners go? You know, from a, I guess, using it perspective. So first of all, here at TechEd, you can meet the gurus, you can meet his team. Sure. Uh, a lot of the sessions as part of the S4HANA Cloud journey map are in there. Here at TechEd to be watched also afterwards. I think the simplest one is www.sap.com slash extend S4. There you're going to find how you're going to do extensions in the application, but also side by side, which is actually his SDK doing the magic that we talked about. Okay, so, so with the SDK, the customer are going to have the, the best of the, the package solutions that are coming from the core, which we're keeping clean, and then their individualizations on top, plus being able to go to a marketplace to see partner solutions as they're developed over time. So Absolutely. it sounds really exciting. I couldn't put it better. Okay, well, thank you very much for your time, guys. It's been, um, been good speaking to you. Um, thank you for watching TechEd Live.